for my next spring cast, I would like to continue on with chapter 9 and I want to review the entries that you make during the accounting cycle the allowance method of accounting for doubtful accounts. I am going to ignore engine or inventory and I'm not going to use numbers. I want you to focus on the entries that you make and how they're described. Are you ready? I want to look at the entries that are made during the accounting period. I want to look at the adjusting entries that are made at the end of the accounting period. And I want to look at what happens on the financial statements. So we're following this in the order of the accounting cycle. So first, let's start with the entries that are journalized during the period. During the accounting period, you'll make entries to record sales by debiting accounts receivable and recording sales. You'll make entries to record payments. Sometimes they'll take discounts. You'll make entries to record write-offs. Remember that term. They debit the allowance account and credit accounts receivable under the allowance method. And you might be lucky enough to reverse a write-off. Somebody changes their mind and actually pays you after you've given up on collecting. Notice we reverse the write-off and then record the payment normally. It's important to do both the reversal and the normal recording of the payment so that your credit reporting on this individual is accurate. They did get old, but in fact, in the end, they paid. We call that slow but good. Those are the typical kind of entries that happen during the accounting period. Let's move on now to entries that are made at the end of accounting period. Adjusting entries. I'm not going to show you how I come up with amounts. I'm just going to show you the entry. We'll discuss how to come up with the amounts later. The entry to record the end of period adjustment is to debit bad debt expense and to credit the allowance account. This entry records the expense in the period that the sales were recorded and it affects the balance sheet by showing a reduced amount for accounts receivable. It shows it at the net realizable value. All adjusting entries affect an income statement account and a balance sheet account. This adjusting entry is no exception. In your homework, you'll be told to create an adjusting entry to estimate what the bad debt expense will be. And so this is the entry that you'll make. It's made at the end of the accounting period as an adjusting entry. And it's the only time an entry is made into the expense account. Let's move on now to see what happens on the financial statements as a result of the above entry. On the income statement notice, I'm reminding you of good headings. Name, income statement for the period covered. You will show sales and you will show the estimate of bad debt expense in the same period, thereby matching the expense in the period that the revenue is recognized. Excellent matching under the allowance method of accounting. Let's move on to the balance sheet. Again, I have used good headings, company name, statement, as of a point in time, and I'm showing under current assets, accounts receivable, less the allowance for doubtful accounts, and showing what we call the net realizable value. Notice it's not named, but it is shown. So, we've reviewed the allowance method without using numbers through the accounting cycle. First, 
we looked at entries that we made during the period. Second, we looked at the adjusting entry made at the end of the period. And third, we looked at the effects on the financial statement. The only thing we really didn't look at was closing entries. The only way closing entries are affected is you now have another expense to close. That debt expense. The allowance account is a contra asset shown on the balance sheet, and there are no closing entries that affect the balance sheet. It's time now to learn something else. What we need to learn now is how exactly do you come up with that bad debt estimate? Stay tuned. Or come back, I guess, and I'll show you that in detail. Thanks.